Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate Asana with Slack. First of all, we have to create our account in Asana and Asana provides us the trial of 30 days, so you better use it. Now, we have to go to the top left corner of Asana. As you can see, once we click at home button, we will go straight to explore the integration. After that, we want to click to explore integration. Once we are here, we have to find Slack. In this case, it's uh, the sixth from the top. So what we want to do is basically click on it. And now the Slack plus Asana notifications will pop up. Now we, what, uh, what we need to do we want we need to do the install asana for slack it will create a new window and you have to sign in to install the asana for slack once you do that just go install you just sign in with your with your account and that's basically it the second way is actually zapier zapier.com provides very easy integrations so uh yeah feel free feel free to create an account here and after that we want to go to the top left corner and we want to make a zap once we are making the zap we have uh, we have to start with uh, trigger one but first of all you can name your zap like this like asana to slack for example and now to start with the first one we want to go with asana as our out uh, as our unco uh, income app we have to choose an event so for example if in asana there's a new user uh, it will trigger something for slack let's go like this you have to sign in with your account continue and now set up a trigger in asana you have to pick the field of uh, field of profession so i've picked the marketing and we pick and we go with continue you can test your trigger but it's not mandatory what we need to do now we have to go to action number two action number two in our case is slack so let's go with slack we have to pick the action event it's let's say update profile so after uh, the new user will will visit asana update profile in slack will occur as a trigger the last thing you just need to sign into slack and that's about it so thanks for watching and see you in the next video